potentially is you'll want to sample at three locations. You want to sample here where they come together. You want to sample here before this comes in and here before it comes into this water body. The reason for doing that is because you have multiple sources of data that you can look at and say, hey, I'm all of a sudden seeing chemicals coming from over here, or I'm getting bad readings coming from over here, and I'm getting bad readings here, so it must be coming from this area. And that way you can kind of cancel out and say, over from this farm area over here, I'm not getting the chemicals that I thought it was. So you know that your non-point source pollution is not really going to be coming from this area. And that's one thing you'll kind of kind of figure as you start more sampling more is you'll want to kind of back up the river and have multiple sites. So, um, and we can help you with that as too, too, if you want to look at a certain stream area. But you want to see your impaired stream, let's put it this way, they don't have enough opportunity to test every single creek that's in the area. Um, so they test the main rivers, your main streams, and then from there, these watershed improvement plans help target where our non-point source pollution is coming from. Does that make sense?